Miami Heat have won 14 in a row against the Charlotte Bobcats. Now that the three-game losing skid is over, the Heat trying to get back to winning. LeBron James, he has success against most all teams in the NBA, in particular the Charlotte Bobcats. He's averaged 28 a game, shooting 67% from the floor in two matchups with them this season. Kemba Walker, the reverse lay-in and the foul, ties it up at 24. And then Charlotte playing well in the first half. Gerald Henderson rattling the rim with a slam. 50 to 46 Charlotte. LeBron James goes between his legs to Chris Bosh for three. Bosh had 25 points. He's had 25 or more in three straight games now for Miami. How about Al Jefferson? Speaking of players playing well, his last three games averaging nearly 30 points and 11 rebounds. Charlotte up seven at halftime. A fan wearing the new Hornets gear that Charlotte will unveil next season. Kemba Walker in the third, driving, injures his left ankle. Ooh, you hate to see those little looks right there where the ankle just rolls up. X-rays did come back negative as you see Kemba being taken off to the locker room by his teammates. It's a sprained ankle for Kemba Walker. Then Ramon Sessions dunking it on LeBron James. Usually it's the reverse angle. LeBron dunking on somebody else, but Ramon Sessions gets the better end of it. As you would say with the folks wearing Hornets gear, Ramon Sessions creating a buzz in the arena, throwing one down on the king. In the fourth quarter, LeBron James finding success with the baseline drive and reverse slam. He says, you know what, that worked for me the first time. Let's dip into the well again. Throws it down Miami by a point at 79-78. Al Jefferson, double-double once again, this time 22 points, 14 rebounds, tying the game up at 90 apiece. Chris Bosh in the corner for three, he misses, but as he comes down court, actually makes contact with the referee, sending him to the mat. Take another look, that left elbow just gets the ref right in the schnoz. Still tied at 90. Udonis Haslam blocked by Gerald Henderson. That should have been an easy deuce for you. But instead, we are tied at 90 with eight seconds to go. Of course the ball is in LeBron's hands. Pulls up for the jumper, and it's no good. Miami headed to overtime for the fourth time this season, most recently losing in double overtime to the Brooklyn Nets a week ago. LeBron high off the window. Gets the lay in, Miami by five. Charlotte off the inbounds now. Ray Allen fouling Gerald Henderson. Henderson would make the free throw, and Charlotte would get the ball back. So basically a free point for the Bobcats. Now down by four, the ensuing possession. Josh McRoberts throws the ball away as LeBron James, on the other end, gets the lay-in. He had 34 points, and LeBron, he's a man of the people. He's gonna pose for a picture, give away some shoes and be a good Samaritan to the folks in the Queen City. Miami, two and two in overtime this season. They win 104-96.